Welcome back, folks. Today, we're diving into the depths of a looming globalist conspiracy that is predicted to take over the world and establish a tyrannical new world order. And who better to discuss this topic with than the infamous Alex Jones, a conspiracy theorist and radio host who has been ringing alarm bells about this for years. Shot 1. The New World Order. What is it? So, what exactly is the New World Order and what makes it such a threat? Essentially, it's a global government structure that would have the power to control every aspect of our lives, from politics and economics to culture and religion. The framing of the idea stems from many apocalyptic millennial Christian eschatologists who have predicted this as the fulfillment of biblical prophecies. This concept has garnered widespread attention and has become a subject of debate and speculation among conspiracy theorists and skeptics alike. The New World Order represents a shift in power dynamics where a select few would hold immense control over the world's resources and decisions. Advocates argue that it would lead to a harmonious and efficient global governance system, promoting unity and progress. However, critics express concerns about potential abuses of power, loss of individual freedoms, and erosion of national sovereignty. One of the major concerns surrounding the New World Order is the potential manipulation of information and censorship. With centralized control, there is a risk of limiting access to knowledge and suppressing dissenting opinions. Critics argue that this would lead to a homogenized society, devoid of diversity and critical thinking. Additionally, Skeptics express worries about the concentration of wealth and resources in the hands of a few powerful entities. They argue that this would exacerbate income inequality and perpetuate a system that benefits the elite at the expense of the majority. Critics fear that economic disparities would widen, creating a global hierarchy that further marginalizes vulnerable populations. The New World Order also raises questions about the preservation of cultural heritage and diversity. With a centralized authority dictating cultural norms and values, there is a possibility of homogenization and the suppression of unique identities and traditions. Critics argue that this could lead to the loss of cultural richness and heritage that defines our global society. Lastly, the New World Order's potential impact on religion has been a source of contention. Some believe that it would undermine religious freedom, favoring certain belief systems over others, or promoting a secular agenda. Skeptics argue that this could lead to a clash between the proponents of the New World Order and religious communities who value their autonomy and faith-based principles. In conclusion, the New World Order represents a complex and controversial idea that has captivated the imaginations of many. Its potential implications span a wide range of areas, including politics, economics, culture and religion. While some view it as a necessary step towards global unity and progress, Others express concerns about power abuses, loss of individual freedoms, and the erosion of cultural diversity. The concept of the New World Order continues to elicit discussions and debates as we navigate an ever-changing global landscape. Shot 2. The Conspirators and Their Motives this globalist conspiracy is believed to be a byproduct of a group of elitist, incredibly rich and powerful people who are determined to maintain their dominance over the world. They are accused of being the puppet masters behind the scenes, and they're pulling the strings of governments, economies, and media organizations in their quest for world domination. These alleged puppet masters possess vast amounts of wealth and influence, 
allowing them to manipulate political agendas, shape economies, and control the flow of information. Their ultimate goal is to establish a new world order, where they hold absolute power and control over all aspects of global affairs. Critics argue that this secret cabal operates covertly, concealing their true intentions behind a facade of philanthropy and global cooperation. They claim that these individuals exploit their positions of power to further their own interests, disregarding the well-being and autonomy of nations and citizens. In their pursuit of world domination, these globalists are said to exercise their control through various means. They are believed to collude with government officials, ensuring that policies and legislation align with their agenda. Additionally, they allegedly use their vast financial resources to influence the media, shaping public opinion, and manipulating narratives to suit their objectives. However, Supporters of this conspiracy theory face skepticism and criticism for their lack of concrete evidence. The idea of a shadowy cabal pulling the strings from behind the scenes appears too far-fetched and implausible to some. Critics argue that it is the result of paranoia and mistrust rather than factual evidence. Regardless of the validity of these claims, the belief in a globalist conspiracy continues to persist among certain segments of society. It fuels deep-seated distrust of institutions and a fear of losing individual freedoms to an unseen, all-powerful few. In conclusion, the notion of a globalist conspiracy revolves around the idea of an elite group of wealthy individuals who seek to maintain their dominance and control over the world. While there may be ongoing debates about the existence and extent of their influence, the fear and suspicion surrounding this theory continue to shape public opinion and discourse. Shot 3. The Consequences of the New World Order if this new world order comes to fruition, it could mean the end of our democracies and personal freedoms as we know them. It could lead to absolute control over every thought, move, and action of citizens. Opponents of this concept believe that the world would become a totalitarian state where our individuality, freedoms, and rights would be completely suppressed. In such a scenario, people would find themselves living in a society stripped of autonomy and self-expression. The very essence of democracy, built upon the foundation of individual freedom and the power to make choices, would crumble before our eyes. No longer would citizens have the ability to voice their opinions or participate in the decision-making process. Instead, they would be subjected to a rigid system of governance that dictates their every move. The suppression of individuality would be a grave consequence of this new world order. The unique characteristics and perspectives that make us who we are would be deemed insignificant and inconsequential. Instead, conformity and uniformity would be enforced stifling creativity and diversity. The world, once a colorful tapestry of different cultures, beliefs and ideas, would transform into a monotonous and soulless entity where everyone is expected to comply without question. Furthermore, the erosion of our rights and freedoms would have far-reaching implications. The fundamental principles upon which our societies have been built, such as the right to privacy, freedom of speech, and the right to assemble peacefully, would be discarded. In their place, a heavy-handed system of surveillance and control would be implemented, leaving no room for dissent or opposition. Those who oppose this concept are alarmed by the potential consequences of this new world order.
They fear a world in which power is concentrated in the hands of a select few, who hold the authority to dictate every aspect of our lives. The absence of checks and balances inherent in democratic systems would pave the way for abuse of power and oppression. Our once vibrant democracies would be reduced to mere illusions, overshadowed by the omnipotent force that dominates all. It is essential that we remain vigilant and protect the principles that define our existence. The preservation of democracy, personal freedoms and individual rights should never be taken for granted. It is only through our unwavering commitment to these values that we can safeguard our societies from the specter of a new world order that threatens to strip us of everything we hold dear. Shot 4. Criticisms, Debates and Misconceptions While conspiracy theorists are convinced that this is the biggest threat to humanity, there are massive debates on its legitimacy. Many people criticize the incoherent nature of the New World Order theory and their lack of concrete evidence. It is also said to be a widely misunderstood concept that has contributed to the growth of cults and fake theories. Shot. 5. The Future of Our World What does the New World Order hold for the fate of humanity? Is it an ominous threat looming on the horizon, or is it nothing more than a fanciful theory? With Alex Jones and me as your guides, you can delve deeper into the truth the fiction, and the misunderstandings surrounding this conspiratorial global agenda. Join us as we dissect the evidence, dispel the myths, and unravel the facts about the New World Order. Together, we will lift the veil on this complex topic and shed light on what the future may bring.